I'm glad this garbage is ending. Hey you, that's right I'm talking to you. Why are you sitting there looking sad? Yeah the show is ending, but no worries, there's a spin-off coming in another week, same moments, same characters, and same channel. Look at it next Saturday at 5pm. A spin-off. Same characters and channels. Man it's like this crap is never gone end. Huey what you trippin' for, the Ram channel is makin' a spin-off of the world's favorite sketch comedy. Hear me out clearly Riley, the show is trash. You just Hayden, the show happens to be funnier than Mad TV and Saturday Night Live. Now them two shows, those are trash. Nah nah nah, don't ever say Mad TV and Saturday Night Live are trashy shows. Mad TV ended with a sad ending, and Saturday Night Live has the most incredible actors ever. Like Kenan Thompson, he has a sitcom on NBC that airs every Tuesday and his character is like a merge of his character on Saturday Night Live, and Kenan. You know what? I'm not finna argue with you about this man. Yeah I was gonna tell you the same thing. You know you like Tina Fey. You look like Tina Fey. Whatever. Whatever. Hello. Can I help you? Are you Huey Freeman? Um. Yes I am. And why do you ask? Wait before you do anything. May I just say, you look beautiful ah uh, thank you so much no problem is there a reason why are you looking for me yes i got kicked off the cheerleading team dang i hate to hear that you wanna know why i got kicked off why is that your grandfather said i look too pretty i mean how do you get kicked off a team for looking too pretty i don't know my granddad is just weird, one time he kicked one of his players off the team, because he had too much hair. Like hair on his head and on his face. So like would you like to come in, have a snack, a drink? No I have to get home and tell my mom what happened, but maybe we can hang out sometime. Sounds great. Yeah, I'll see you later. Wait I forgot to ask, what's your name? I'm Faith. Faith Green. Huey Freeman. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I love meeting girls. That's the most coolest thing to do being born a male. I think I'm about to make me a diary. See, you're talking out of controversy. See, that's what's wrong with the world today. Granddad, can we talk for a minute? You don't have to ask, can we talk, Huey? If you want to talk, go ahead. It's a free country. You're right, I don't have to ask. Look that girl, Faith. She came by here last night, and she wanted to ask why did you kick her off the cheerleading team? Because I couldn't stand her. She was such a sassy queen. She told me you kicked her off because she looked too pretty. Yeah, she reminds me of your auntie. She would always make herself look like a damn role model for bodybuilders and thugs. Like she makes me sick. Granddad, you do know that's your own daughter you're talking about. I know. I'm glad I've never had you guys visit her. She was 35 acting like she was 18. Nowadays she's only 53 probably acting like she 36 or younger. Like, ugh. Granddad, I think she's probably not ready to lose her youth. That's the problem. Oh please Huey. That woman is gonna end up losing it when she turns 60. Trust me I know. What the woman losing youth talk is going on in here? I'm about to go take a nap. Granddad, 
It's ten o'clock in the morning. Boy, I might be old, but I'm still grown. I can make any choices I want. Look, little kid, we gotta go to Faith's house and talk to her about why did Granddad kick her off the cheerleading team. Who the hell is Faith? The girl who came by last night. I don't know this Faith you talking about, G. She's from the plotted on Sparkler's cheerleading team. Okay, now you making it sound a little familiar. I'm assuming you're talking about the one who looked like a female version of Jesus, or the one who looks like a nerd, and she got the nickname Froggy from the jocks. No, I'm talking about the one who made the Hoochie Dance. Hoochie Dance? Yay. Yeah. Hoochie Dance. Wait a minute, you talking about Faith from the Music Party. Faith from the Music Party. You was talking about Cheetah Girl Faith. Wait, Granddad kicked her off the cheerleading team? Yay. Yeah. Why he do that? She reminded him of Aunt Kiara. What's wrong with Aunt Kiara? She look and dress young like she a teenager again. I don't know. Granddad just got problems watching people between 40 to 55 not losing their youth. He expects because they turn 40 they supposed to act old. Yay, forget that. Look, since you talked to her at the door yesterday, how about I go to her house and talk to her about this? You don't do that. Yay, I'll be back. Okay. Throw me off the team, old ass negro is something else. I'm the most prettiest. Faith? What are you doing here? Before I answer that, I'm Riley, Riley Freeman, Coach Freeman's youngest and most active grandson. Okay. Riley Freeman. Do me a favor and sit down. Okay. Not there. On the couch? Oh, my bad. This must be your seat. Perfect. So. So. You not gun kill me, are you? Of course not, I was a cheerleader, not a murderer. Okay, I'ma trust you on this. <clears throat> okay, so. Coach Freeman and I talked about how you were released from the cheerleading team, right? He says you are a pretty girl and all. But you reminded him too much of our... Aunt Kiara. Wa ha 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 ha. Damn. I mean. Did something I said hurt your feelings? Wa ah, ha ha. No, it ain't that. Hey, 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 come on now. She ain't ugly. She pretty as hell. Um, hum, um, hum, um, hum, um, hum, um, hum. She old, but she look young. She reminds everybody of Jennifer Lopez. Wa ah, ha 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 ha. Oh lordy, what have I done? I made a pretty girl cry. Wah. Wah. Ha 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 ha. W A H O O O O O O O O O O. I didn't know you stopped. Why were you crying? Well, um, actually, I wasn't crying. I was uh doing something. Our mother taught me to stop me from crying. You know she wanted me to live the tough life. You know like Debo, Damon, and um Lorenzo. Yeah I know they're all muscular men. Look how about let's put this kicked off the cheerleading team situation aside and we go out for a burger or something. You know something? That sound good right now? I'm in. Let's do this. Okay. Hey, when I was on the couch crying, you said I was pretty? Um. Yeah I said it. Thank you. I'm beginning to like you. I'm beginning to like you too. Ah. Oh. Come on, let's go eat. She loves me. She loves me. How is that one? Oh damn. So sexy, I can't tell if I'm in a dream or reality. Okay, do you see Fatty Wap anywhere? No, I don't. Well, this is reality. Oh man. Faith? I didn't know you was here. I'm sorta curious like, are you playing charades with Riley? Najee, she's showing me sexy memes in person, whoa.
Ooh, it's getting late. I gotta go. Hey, Faith. Ah. Uh, this was fun. Next time we go out, you know like movies, out to eat, anywhere like that and other fun places. Yay, yeah, sure. I'll call you when I'm not busy. Sounds great. I'll see you then. Okay, bye. That girl is something, ain't she? Yeah, she is. I was thinking, gee, next time Faith and I go out on a date, we should make a double date. Yeah, that's cool and a little kid, but Tatiana's been busy with so much things. Like what? Train them to get you to get a vasectomy in the future? <laughs> no, not with that. She's been busy with family issues. Family issues, huh? Like, are they gonna prepare to go to war against each other for the plot of their own rights? <laughs> no, you weirdo, that's not it either. She's been busy with something she just won't tell me. Well, it is family business, so of course she won't share with you. Well, I'm finna go upstairs and take out all outfits I'm aware on my dates with Faith. Yay, good luck with her little bra. You got 50 cents I can borrow. You evil bitch. This 2K22 is lit as hell bra. Let's go Chicago. Let's go. Riley, we gotta talk bra. Not now Huey. Not now Huey nothing. Yes now. It's about Faith. Come on Huey I'm in the middle of 2K. Riley, I saw Faith laying next to a trash can outside, she was wearing a faux fur coat, and she was holding her cup with some coins in it. Riley I might be wrong, but I think Faith is a... DAMN! Lost again. What was you saying G? I think Faith is a... What? I think Faith is a... What? Get up and come here. I said I think Faith could be a... Now you trippin', Faith wouldn't be that. Look at this. Okay. I see a girl wearing a black faux fur coat. Watch when it zooms in. Okay, zooming in, long hair, looks a lot like Faith. What the holy hell? That is Faith. Told you. So you mean Faith is a- Yes she is. What's wrong with that nigger? I don't know, but she's crazy. Man I can't believe I dated that girl. I mean she pretends to be a normal girl when I see her, but when I don't see her she's that. 
Chill out, bra. You need a drink. Yeah, you right. I need some water. But how she gone do me like that, G? I think Granddad made a really good choice to kick her off the cheerleading team. You think? Yay, we just let Granddad know he just threw a whore off the team. That's probably her. I forgot to tell you to dump her. Dump her? Yeah, you ain't got no time dating, no. Dirty whore. I'ma go sit in the kitchen while y'all talk. Fosho G. Baby boy. Hi, 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 hi. Hi, 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 hi. How you been, Rai Rai? Good, Fei Fei. So, do you have any idea where shall we go? Um, Faith, can we talk for a second? Sure. Okay. Like this is one where you have to sit and listen. Okay. Faith? I don't want to hurt you and all, but I don't think our relationship will work out well. Riley. We have so much fun together, of course it's working out well. Matter of fact, it's working fantastic. Yea, sooner or later it's gone to become critic-tastic. But seriously, I don't think our relationship is gone fly good. Okay, now you're just overreacting. No, 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 at this very moment I am underreacting. Well, if you're underreacting, you say, prove to me that you're underreacting. Okay, I'ma break it out to you like this. I don't think our relationship will work out right you know what i shared my heart and soul with you i listened to you tell me i was pretty and i told you i'm beginning to like you i bust my ass off going out with you to the cafe the love boat and going to the haunted house even though it's not october and now you want to stomp my heart out to death I mean you are a pretty girl. Oh shut up you idiot. Faith. Ah! Oh, damn! How it go bro? She didn't take it good. Don't worry about it little kid. It's just the beginning of heart changing. <laughs> I'm telling you, Granddad, that girl was a dirty whore. You mean I got rid of a girl who was found in a ditch, and she always asked for 50 cents? Yes, instead of in a ditch I found her by a trash can. So the girl is a gutter slut. Granddad. Oh, y'all need to grow up. Y'all know she was that when y'all seen her yesterday. Yeah, you right. She is a gutter slut. Faith? Uh, what are you doing here? Riley's not here if you're looking for home. I ain't here for Riley. Well, what are you here for? I'm here to see your grandfather now move. Coach Freeman, I'm actually pretty happy you got rid of me, because I thought to myself, it don't matter who cheerleading team I'm on, as long as I'm in a game. Come in, Faith. How are you doing, Faith? It's a pleasure to hear from you. Another thing, that's a sweet way of thinking of yourself. Yay, I'm still cheerleading, but just not at the moment. I'm be taking a little break. Well, what are you telling me for? You ain't my damn student. But I do got one question. If it's why do you remind me of my daughter don't even ask. It ain't that Coach Freeman. The question is why did Riley dump me? Well, I guess it's something about Huey catching you talking to another boy while wearing a faux fur coat. What? Faith, I don't know how to put it to you, but I might have to be real with you. Okay. Faith, I saw you down the street a skin somebody for some change yesterday. You was sitting by the trash can wearing a faux fur coat. Oh. I was playing a scene. I was playing a sexy homeless girl. 
Ha 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 What'd she say, Huey? Play in a scene, a sexy homeless girl. Why don't you tell her what you thought she was doing? What you thought was going on? Uh, hold up a minute. Hey, Riley. Come down here. What's up? Hey, so Faith say the reason she was wearing a faux fur coat was because she was playing a sexy homeless girl who asks for 50 cents. <laughs> What is going on? For God's sakes, the boys thought you were a gutter slut. I'm going upstairs. You what? Yes, it's true. You let your brother tell you I was a gutter slut? Aa, you was wearing that long black fur coat. You was holding a glass of change. That change was the change I was holding onto for my payment to college. Wait, 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 college? That's right, college. Who the hell pays for college wit coins? Hey, if you can run 400 miles from the island to the pier, you can make a college payment with coins. That's ridiculous. Says who? Says anyone. You're paying for college by giving the people a bucket of coins. You know what? You two are sick and just plain stupid. Faith Green don't have to take this nonsense from two busters. This girl is got to bounce. And for y'all informations I'd love to be a gutter's lot before going out on a date with you two gutless idiots. Well I guess we all know her choice of being in a relationship or staying single. Yep. Rock to the rhythm you don't stop.